Akira and DSP Dragon. You try and eat all the chips. Uh, I don't want chips. I will can My you body right? isn't enough pain as it is. Speaking totally oh. legitly, how was Hi, viewers. Everyone? Guess what? Oh. We're going back up. Damn it. I at least wanted this verified before we recorded. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> you actually did. You actually left a comment. It's like, please give me notification when we're starting. And you did it! I'm sorry. Well, uh, you know what? I just messed up. You know what? Well, I'm a master. No, 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 no. Just calm down. Okay. We're doing take two and three... Two, one. Hi, viewers. How are you doing today? Oh man, let me tell you, my body is in so much pain that I, uh, I can feel everything. I also, Owl have... Flame is back. I... Say hi, Owl Flame. Hi. How well can people hear me? I mean, how well can you hear me? First off, because I'm actually. I can hear you, but God help me, I, I don't know if this is gonna pick up a lot on the mic, and I'm gonna have to edit like 15 bajillion parts. Do hey, I it's sound? Gallery door. <laughs> Shooting gallery. Okay. And there's the merchant man. Hi, merchant man. Sell Welcome. me something. Got some rare things. Do I have noise? Eddie, you're in the way. <laughs> Ground. What are you buying? Uh, okay. So, Owl Flame, what's yeah. on your mind? You uh, whether or not there's noise in the background for me. I I can't hear anything. Alright. But then again, <laughs> I have uh, altered my headphone volume, so uh, it, it's pretty low, so you, hopefully you won't pick up when uh, I'm commentating. Also, I I noticed while I was uh, recording the volume for my own voice, it was really low. So I wanted to try to boost that up a bit. Yeah, you're right. I think I'm going to keep the grenade. What are you buying? Let's see, what else can we do? Still got that striker, man. Yeah! Is that the really ridiculous gun? That is the very ridiculous gun. Come back. It's uh, your new favorite gun, Owl Flame. You have no say in this, it's your new favorite game. No, no! It's your new favorite game, it's it your new favorite be. gun. This can't be! It, That's it impossible! It is the best gun ever, says you. That's impossible. From me. Also, we have villagers again. Hi, <laughs> villagers. This could have just been regular missed you. That was complete fail. Wow. You are so good at video games. <laughs> I know. Isn't that amazing? And here I thought I could go a whole day with... with uh, I, uh, and those were called noises. Noises are a good thing. I just you make them. You're alive. Off. Does that make Leon a murderer? Probably not. No, they're already dead. Actually, but... if that's all. If that's well, all the why logic. Why does that make it when you kill something that's already dead? I don't think Is that you even can possible. Kill. I don't think you can kill something that's already How... dead. Okay, incapacitate something that's already dead. What does that make you? I mean, you can't do it. If it's dead, it's dead. But what if it's still moving? That's not I mean, possible. What 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 this is, is it this, when uh This is not a scenario that will come up ever. What is it? When, uh, you defeat zombies, what does that make you? A zombie slayer? Like, is there something equivalent to killing a zombie that's not actually involving death? Because you clearly can't bring them back to life like this is Final Fantasy or something. It doesn't work that way. Also, Hatchet Man, you are ridiculous. You brought your three brothers. Hatchet Man... Senior and Hatchet Man Junior. And then there's just Actually, I have no way of checking to see if that works. Supposedly, the earphones I'm using also come with a microphone, and I just wanted to know if they work. Do I sound closer now? I have no idea. 
How about now? Now do I sound outrageously close? You sound outrageously far away. Oh no! By the way, Alflame. Yes. By the way. Yes. I'm totally addicted to. I'm totally addicted to Final Fantasy X now. I really want to go play it. Oh no! Not Final Fantasy X. I will never understand the dispute why people hate it, but then again, it was I played at a time in which I was incredibly impressionable by the game, so... I've always liked it! Do people really hate it? Some people really don't like it, to the point where they will make arguments why it's a Cause, terrible game. Because from a game or story standpoint, or both, it's just bland. That's like its worst problem, and... You can't really hate something that's bland, because that's just... That's just not fair, because it could be so much worse. In Final Fantasy X... Final Fantasy X could have been so much worse. Final Fantasy X... I, I, think, I think that's the equivalent why I don't like X2. To me, that is so much worse. I mean, gameplay-wise, it's fantastic, but plot-wise, it's, it's so much worse. Some people really like it, though. And by all are... means, for those people that actually enjoy it, there's nothing wrong with that. I need to get out of the way of being hit with a hatchet. That would be a first step towards not dying. See, whenever someone has an opinion about a game, people I usually always have a usually... game. Some people I usually... like. Usually in that situation, I try to be like, "Oh, cool, you have your opinion," but then I at least want you to acknowledge, like, if I say, like. I'm not saying that you're bad for liking it, I would at least like you to be able to acknowledge, like, if I say a game's bad, I'm usually talking about, like, how things from a writing standpoint, how things from a gameplay standpoint failed from a design standpoint, and then I would at least like you to acknowledge those. If you can't, and pointing these out offends you that I'm, that I'm being mean to your favorite thing, you will immediately annoy me as a person. Oh, no. I mean, like, every... The, no, nothing with, is without flaw. I mean, everything will always have flaws. I've, I've had discussions like this. I, I actually was talking to people the other day, and they're just like, I like Persona 4. I'm just like, I hate Persona 4. Also, it's a bad game. Because people can See, like it, like and it's a bad game. I feel like that's kind of opinionated, though. I and I, I mean that's fine. You're you're. I, I want to I want to separate my opinion of the game and the knowledge that from a writing standpoint, gameplay standpoint, uh, it was actually decent, but from a writing standpoint, it was terrible. And see, I feel like you have every right to say why, it's, like, not as good of a game as it could have been. You know. Yes. Everyone has the right to their own opinions. No one. Damn it! Doing because I, I write well, not as much anymore. But I've I've taken like writing classes. I've I've learned all the do's and don'ts. And then I played Persona 4, and it was all the don'ts, all of the don'ts. And yet people liked it, which is cool if you liked it. I'm not saying if you can't. People people like things that yeah, I'm gonna stop. Well, uh, I gotta be. To be fair, I never really got too far into Persona 4. I mean, honest to God, I have no opinion on it because I didn't play... I didn't really even play it. I started it up and then for whatever reason, I just couldn't bring myself to playing it. I think oh. it's because I oh. played Persona 3. And I'm not going to say that I hate Persona 3 because I actually love the game. I thought it was a fantastic game. That's a good reason um, not to say you hate something. But the thing is, it also reminded me how drawn out Persona 3 was. And I think... Oh, well, that was fair. Um, yeah, I rem Persona 3 was pretty drawn out. I mean, it takes place on a day-by-day -day basis. So, you're going to be playing the game for, out, like, a few days, regardless. I feel like that's just something that you cannot avoid. The 
considering it has the day-by-day scenario.